hello everyone this is linda welcome to my youtube channel today i will be showing you how to do an nsfast online application so you start by typing nsfast nsfast then you search then you click here you click my nsfast then you scroll down Then here you provide your ID number and your password, then you click login. Then you click apply now. Click yes. Scroll down. You accept the terms and conditions here. Yeah? Okay. Then you click accept. Then you can now start your NSFAS funding application, starting by institution information so here if you have a disability you can click yes if not you click no so i don't have a disability i'll click no then your highest academic level i have metric which is grade 12. yes if you have a national diploma you can click national diploma then for which year are you applying for i'm applying for 2024 for this year select three institutions so here on institutions i've applied at university of limpombo i will search university of limpombo i'll just type limpombo limpombo you see in the university of limpombo I'll click the university of limpombo and i've also applied at Tswane university of technology i'll search Tswane. Tswane click Tswane. So I have only applied to two universities, which is University of Limpopo and Tswane University of Technology. If you have applied to three universities, you can add another university to make it three. Okay, so study information. At University of Limpopo, I have applied for education. So I'll look for the field of study that is related to education. I will scroll down higher certificate, education and training is related to education. I can provide this one. Then on Swan University of Technology, I've applied for agriculture. I would click primary agriculture is related to agriculture. And then, so you have to provide three field of study. It is compulsory. So which means I'll, I'll have to add another field of study here to make it three so that i'll be able to proceed to the next page i'll click here choose a field of study that is can add maybe um, early childhood development yes then i can click next yeah. provide the address information your street number your street name town province and postal code okay let me provide my street number Then I'll click next. Then I'll scroll down. Then I'll click the terms and condition here. Then I'll click asset. So as you can see there on top, application submitted successfully. So I can view my application now. I've submitted my application. I have two applications here. The first one is my new application for 2024. This one, it was my previous application for 2023. So I'm done now. So this is what I wanted to show you guys. Hope you'll be able to do your reapplication or to apply for NSFAS funding for 2024 and i wish you all the best may god bless you bye bye